Okay, uh, hello and welcome. Um, so I just got home from work and there is a huge package on my bed. <laughs> um, I kind of don't real. I don't know what it is right now. I'm kind of, I can't think right now properly, but I need to get this video out of the way because I'm going to forget. But look at this. I forget what it is. It just tells me what it's the delivery stuff. Like it doesn't mention what it is, and I can't in the top of my head think of what it is. So obviously the video is going to be titled whatever it is in the thumbnail. But as of now recording, I cannot think of, of the life of me what it is. It's packaged neatly. Like it feels like there's a good amount of bubble wrap in there. Oh yeah, there's a lot of bubble wrap on that. It's like Christmas. I'm trying to be in a good mood. I, you know, getting back from work is difficult, but I have tomorrow off. I have pizza that I got from work. I want to relax. Oh, wait a minute. I think I know what this is. Yeah. So a while ago, I made a video where I unboxed. It's right here. I unbox this, which is the Force Effects Elite um, Darth Revan lightsaber. I remembered I before I bought this. This is like almost a month ago. I bought one from Amazon. Now again, I wasn't sure if I would trust Amazon for something like this, but it's supposed to be the same brand as the Revan one. Now, the Revan one, the Revan one I got at my local game store, and it cost me $500, which is probably expensive, and it was expensive, but I like supporting my local game store because I love the, it's my game store. This one I bought off Amazon for, I think, around $350, including shipping. So, without further ado, getting all this bubble wrap off, I'm just going to, I don't care for the bubble wrap, I don't need it, so. Oh yes, this is it. So, this, oh, it looks good. This is the Ray Skywalker Force, Effect, Force Effects Elite Lightsaber. It's the Black Series, it says. I have the cover for the other one, let me just check if that's a Black Series. Um, no. So, that one is a, the Revan one is a Force Effects Elite lightsaber. This one is Force Effects Elite, but it's the Black Series it's called. I don't know the difference, really, but let's get to cracking. Now, the reason, so last time when I did the unboxing, I put the Revan lightsaber together, and when I activated it accidentally... It turned on. The reason was because at my game store, they have they had two lightsabers displayed, the Luke Skywalker one and the uh, Revan one. When I bought the Revan one, they took it off the display and packaged it back up. So that's why that already had batteries in it. This one most likely won't, but I have batteries here. So if it comes to it, I'll just pause the video and do the batteries then. But... For now, oh, I'm sorry. Let's unbox it. Oh, this looks way different. <laughs> so off the bat, again, just like last time, we have the stand. However, this one has a ring. Mm -hmm. So I guess the way the lightsaber is probably different, but. And also the top's got a ring on it as well. So I guess it's just the way the lightsaber's displayed. So keep that there. Um, get rid of that. I have a knife here. Uh-huh. Oh, Alright, there's the instruction booklet and stuff. So, you know. The blade looks very different. All right, pulling up the hilt. Oh, ho, ho, ho. That is heavy. That is extremely heavy. So 
Look at that. It's got that nice rust look. You see the bandage things there. There's the end. Here's the emitter. It looks closed up. I don't know if I can open that. So I'm going to try... Is that just... Oh! They sit up like that. That's cool. This is heavy. Like, it's it weighs twice as heavy as this one. Really, it does. So lengthwise, this one's only taller because of the little spike things here. But that's heavy. That's really heavy. Uh, yeah. Um... All right, um, I'll get the blade ready because I really want to find out if this is something I need to um, put batteries in. Oops. Probably shouldn't be doing it like this, but I'm lazy. So the blade is very different. Like, look at the, the blade feels lighter, way lighter than that one. And that part on the end isn't a plastic. It's plastic, but it's not the covering like the other one has. So do they have the thingies on them? Yes, they do. So I know which ones to put in. Lock it. Put this on. Right. Feels oddly loose, but screw it. Um, okay, I'm definitely going to have to put batteries in this. Oh, yes. So. Um, yeah, I don't, I'm pretty, these are new, bat like these batteries I haven't used, but I don't know if, I'm pretty sure I bought these batteries a long time ago, so I don't know if they're charged or not. I'm really hoping they are, but I guess we'll find out. Um, do I just... Like that? All right. That's on. I'm going to turn the light off. Hopefully I've got it set so it's working. Um, so the way it feels loose, but I'm going to try and see what this does. All right. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, yes. The way it comes up, it flashes green on this part, and then it comes up. Look at this. That is neat. Is that, what's that? Oh, so this one, you, you flick it on and off by flicking this thing. However, there's a little button here, and when you press it, it does the blast with the flex, so I assume holding it in. Yeah, there we go. Oh my god. <laughs> this lightsaber is hefty and so good. I'm going to turn the light back on real quick. Oh my god. Now... This is not a popular, like, lightsaber to most, but I got it for two reasons. Number one, my top three favorite lightsaber colors in order, number one is orange. You cannot find orange like, like this, at least, anywhere. Second is yellow, because I love Sentinel, so that's why I liked getting... This is, like, the only yellow one at the moment that I could get. 
And then lastly is Purple, which again, I got Revan because Revan's my favorite character with the whole idea of he wears a Mandalorian mask and good and evil, you know, all that shit. I got this again because I, I liked the lightsaber that Ray has. And again, it is yellow. I love yellow. So I got this, but it is funny to me. I bought this off Amazon about a week before I bought the Revan one. So it's taken a while, but I'm glad it come in. Now, it said it was supposed to come in, like, next month. So I'm glad it came in early. This is early. Like, this is probably half a month. I'm happy. All right, so I'm going to do this with the light on. I love it so much. I love the way, if you look close when it ignites, it's not too noticeable because of the light, but it flashes green real, real quick and then it goes up. Oh my god, this is my new favorite lightsaber now. Oh yes, okay. I'm going to try and take this off now and see if it's like that one where I can activate it with the blade off in a way. So put this on it. These go down, which is nice. Okay. So it makes a noise like it can't go up. That's kind of cool. Right, I'm going to put this on here. So I shoot... Oh, yes. Oh. Look at the way that sits. That's actually pretty dope. It's taller than that one, at least. So... Right, so that's just out of the way. That... Oh, if you could feel how heavy this is. This is heavy. Like... I have a Mandalore, I have a dark saber over there. It's an RGB, but that hilt is heavy because it's all steel. This feels heavier than that. I like this so much. Mm, definitely love this. If you just love a lightsaber like this for display in that, this is just, this is the way to go. This is a nice feeling lightsaber. And unlike the Revan one, you have a grip here. You can grip it. The Revan one, it's kind of hard to, because the bottom, you, the only way to grip it is on the bottom part, and you're essentially holding it like this. And then if you hold it over the thing, your hand's going over it. But the way that looks as well, that's really nice. And they fold up when you don't have a, when you put the lightsaber in it, they fold up. So that's really nice. So, yeah, I'm excited. And it's got a nice little hook thing here, which I guess I could hook to my pants, maybe. Maybe not. It feels too heavy. I don't think it'll hook on that well, but I love it. I love this. And it, despite the fact all these strings are coming off, it kind of, again, it looks, it doesn't even look like, you know, it's paint or anything. It just looks like it's actually rusty. It looks so good. So that's just this video out of the way, a nice quick one. At this point in time, I have nothing else that I've ordered, so really for a month or so I might just not do unboxings. I do plan to go back to it eventually. I'd love to find more of these. There is a dark saber. I want to get it. It's somewhere out there. I'm sure I could pay for it. It's probably going to be costly, but I'm sure I could get it. The dark saber is one I would love to get. But until then, thank you for watching. And I will see you in the next one.